wants it because we know you have a lot of fanfare, you're already all over the South African media. So we wanted to make sure that we had a small intimate session with you because at Divinity we believe in unique individuals and you are certainly one. So we welcome you to South Africa and we thank you so much for joining us. You sitting in front, that is Professor Ben Anderson, a little bit older professor than you. <laughs> but he is indeed a brilliant mind himself. And it is, he's our executive chairperson of the Da Vinci Institute, and he's in charge of the entire institute and all of our students. As a distance provider, our students come from many parts of the world, and that is why we find ourselves to be an accessible institution. So without further ado, I'd like to introduce to you Prof. Barry and Prof. Anderson to engage a little bit with us. And most importantly for us, and I think this is really important, is that the uniqueness of every student and every individual is embraced at Divinity, and we hope um, that you will also find that. So thank you very much, Prof. Anderson. Over to you. So, so the idea is that we will engage and that hopefully in the short time that we have together, we would leave with some ideas and be connected in a totally new galaxy connecting strangers and hopefully take a journey. I think too often we are passers by and we don't connect. So I hope that you can connect and that some of us can reconnect in the conversation that we will be having. But it is all about the energy flow. So thanks for allowing us to bring you and your family into this intimate circle. There are beautiful minds around the table uh, some of them asked to bring a guest with them. So there's also new energy around the world, around this space. Of particular importance this morning is that um, we want to talk about looking forward and backward at the same time. So I almost want us to stretch our minds like the shamans would do and elevate their mind to the level of the condor, looking at tomorrow rolling in while yesterday is rolling out. So this conversation should not be time bounded. And I hope that we can all stretch ourselves in our discussion to go beyond what is known to us, to an unknown reality. So over time, uh, Professor Bari, you have now become part of a circle of scientists acknowledged most probably because of your expertise in algorithmic engagements. You can do calculations, you can do, you can play with, with numbers. To a large extent, the world in the last century has been governed by numbers. 